गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन नाउ कम टू द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक दैट इज इंट्रोडक्शन टू इंटरनेट एंड दिस इज द टॉपिक विच आई हैव टेकन फ्रॉम यूनिट नंबर फोर एज यू हैव कवर्ड द रेस्ट ऑफ द टॉपिक्स दैट इज यूनिट नंबर वन टू एंड थ्री सो नाउ कम टू द नेक्स्ट यूनिट दैट इज यूनिट नंबर फोर एंड लाइक इन टू डेज वीडियो लेक्चर आई विल टेल यू अबाउट लाइक वॉट डू मीन बाई इंटरनेट एंड मीन्स वॉट इज द बेसिक इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ इंटरनेट Uh, and uh, like uh, the history of internet so basically uh, these two things will be covered in today's video lecture the introduction to internet as well as the history of uh, internet then so uh, this is one image related to internet like uh, number of pcs are connected within one network is known as internet so with the help of which how you can define the term that is internet so basically if i'll tell you about internet then we can see that the internet or the net basically we use the term that is net so a net means or the internet means the network of networks because number of computers are connected within this computer network so that is why we can say that internet l means the network of networks and it is the largest computer network in the world that connects billions of computer users from one location to the world okay so uh, we can see some more things related to this internet like it is a very large or wide area network connecting the computers and the networks around the world that is known as internet because uh, you can connect to your computer in two ways the first one is lan with the help of uh, like local area network you can connect to your computer because for example you are having uh, like number of computers and you are in one single lab so basically with the help of lan area network what you can do you can connect the different number of pcs but this is known as lan network but if you want to send the information or if you want to receive the information from uh, like different different locations i means outside the lab outside the world uh, like uh, outside your uh, country then uh, for that purpose you have to use wan means wide area network so for that purpose uh, like uh, there is one facility that is known as internet and network is a collection of computer as well as some devices which are connected via communication channels and some transmission media also because this term is very much important without which you cannot access the internet as we say in terms of uh, operating system that operating system is one interface without which you cannot uh, like work on computer system so same like in case of computer network also if we are not having any kind of transmission uh, like uh, media or hardware if you are not having any kind of uh, hardware then how you can connect uh, to the internet for example like if you want to connect your computer with modem like if you want to access the internet from telephone lines so for that purpose first of all you have to take one modem so that you can connect your pc with that particular uh, the uh, network of your telephone line so same in terms of computer network also now uh, like if you want to add some more things in terms of internet then we can also say that computer network acts as a single huge network for the transport transportation of data messages media video audio across distances which can be anywhere from one location to anywhere in the world that means like if you want to more uh, like if you want to elaborate more uh, the term that is internet that we can say that the internet is a network of computers uh, which are basically linking many different types of computers all over the world okay so basically in this simple definition you can define the internet like internet is a network of computers linking many different types of computers all uh, around the world so this is basically about internet and obviously it makes it possible for millions of users to connect to one another via like telephone lines cable lines even though with the help of satellites also then 
so this is uh, all about internet and uh, like if anyone asks from you that who was the father of internet then you can say that went curf was the father of internet basically went curf has invented or uh, done the evaluation or uh, like evolution of this term that is internet done so went curf was the father of internet and uh, like uh, if you want to add some more points within this internet uh, term then we can also say that uh, an, a network additionally enables associated pcs to share the documents and information and also the equipment assets like scanners plotters projectors storage devices means you can connect all these devices making it simpler to gather and administer data and enabling the clients to work together like uh, for example you are having only one sing uh, one single printer but if everyone want to use uh, that device that is a printer for uh, all of the system then what can be done so for that purpose you can share that device okay so basically uh, like uh, if you are using lan network in your lab then obviously one single printer can be shared by different different pcs so this is also one kind of like network like this this is what this is like uh, these are different different pcs and for example you want to connect your pcs with internet and for accessing the internet you want to use telephone lines then obviously if you want to use the uh, internet from the telephone line then for that purpose you have to use one modem so basically this is your modem and uh, if you are connecting it with modem then obviously one router should be there so this is one router who will pass the signal to your pcs and uh, each and every pc has one single or one uh, like unique ip address each pc has one uh, unique ip address uh, as you can see so for accessing the internet what you are using like uh, with the help of uh, modem you are accessing the internet so basically for that purpose uh, we have taken one picture also but in nowadays we can uh, connect the pcs or laptops with the help of wifi also like number of things are there uh, even though uh, you are having different number of options to connect to the internet now come to the next topic that is uh, history of internet so as uh, the system was simply not advanced like in the earlier time the system was not advanced so for the advancement of system administration begin in 1969 by the improvement of first system that is known as arpanet so this term is very much important that is arpanet so what is arpanet arpanet is basically the first system on which the internet was developed okay so which was it was prompted by the improvement of web and uh, what is the full form of arpanet because in the mcqs uh, it can be asked like what is the full form of arpanet so for that purpose you should know like what is the full form of this so a stands for advanced here r stands for research then uh, arpa then a stands for agency and net stands for network okay so arpanet basically stands for advanced research project agency this p stands for project okay so a stands for advanced research project agency network then so basically advanced research project agency started an experimental computer network so this uh, this project agency started the experimental computer network and uh, at that time there was no server but equal importance and participation was given to every computer within the network so this was the uh, like one important term in case of this arpanet if you want to know more about this arpanet then i can tell you like arpanet it was the network that became the basis for the internet and it was the first network that came into existence in 1969 
and who designed the sarpanet this is one question so the sarpanet was designed and named by the advanced research project agency and us department of defense so this dod stands for department of defense so which department of defense us department of defense so basically these two organizations invented the term that is arpanet and basically this is the uh, like older name of internet before like uh, the term internet uh, we used to call uh, this internet that is arpanet okay and it was uh, where a bunch of feces were associated at various colleges and us defense of uh, department department of defense for sharing of information and for sharing the messages for playing long separation diversions and associating with individuals to share their perspective so basically if the department of defense want to like send some messages to the other uh, person or department then for that purpose they have invented the term that is internet so basically this was the history of arpanet hope you have understood like uh, what was the history of internet and what exactly the meaning of this internet so went curve was the father of internet as i have told you so till then you just learn from this video and you just note it down also so thank you everyone thank you so much